Sponsored by Ukrainian Credit Union. Believe it or not, it's Ron Kahoot with Stay Ukrainian, my friends. We're Cossack children of history. Well, boys and girls, here we are. We are in Windsor, driven all the way to Windsor for a whole bunch of stuff today. Uh, but we're starting off the day with uh, Father Eugene Halitsky. Um, by the way, this church is um, St. Uh, Vladimir and Olga. Both calendars, Vikazale. Both, both calendars, mainly new calendar, mainly. Ale možu kazate slavu Isusu Kristu abo Kristos voskres. It depends on which side of the fence. Exactly, exactly. Now, before we get into the church, Father, um, I discovered the connection that I have with you from years ago at St. Demetrius on, on the Rose Avenue, and yes. you were ordained with Father Terry. As a deacon. As a yeah. deacon. Yes. But you were ordained by by Slipe in Castel Patriarch Gandolfo. Patriarch Joseph Slipe in Castel Gandolfo in 73. That's a big, that's big time, eh? Big, big that's time. big time. 40 years ago. 40 years ago. Exactly. And you almost look the same. <laughs> a little bit, change it with the, the hair. The hair, yeah, that's, but that's God's sense of humor. <laughs> yes. Brand new church. Yes, it is. How old? Oh, we blessed the church, uh, uh, Bishop Stefan blessed in April of 11, 2011. So two years, really, we are in this church celebrating divine liturgies. And you've been here a long... Where was the church before here? On Langlois and Shepherd. The church is still there. Uh, some Pentecostals are using the church. They bought the church from the eparchy. And I'm in this parish 33 years this year. Wow. 33 years. What happened for the first seven? Thunder Bay, five years, my first parish, and two years in London, Ontario, and since then, Windsor. Windsor. Yes. Wow. That's I'm something. very happy in this parish. I feel at home, very at home. It's beautiful, beautiful, beautiful church. Thank you. So let's, let's talk about the iconostas. <laughs> about the iconostas. Why does it look like St. Demetrius' iconostas? You said because it's one of two designs? It was designed by one of the members of that community, Father Michael Barida, the late Father Michael Barida. And as I was told, this iconostas didn't fit their church. It was the plans uh, yes. then were adjusted to yes. our church. In it's Vincent. too high. It looked like too high, but many people like because of the brass. The brass looks like absolutely, gold. Absolutely, absolutely. The iconography is beautiful. It's from Father Theodor Kufos, a Greek Orthodox yeah. priest, and oh. it's a beautiful iconography. And um, also the new chandelier we got, was purchased by a parishioner. That's very Byzantine. It's very from Greece, from, came from Greece, especially for this church. And uh, I love this church because it's so bright, big windows, lots of light. It's a, uh, but everything came from the old church, including the pews. Oh, really? The altars, the iconostas, everything fit in this church. We asked the architect to design in a way. It's uh, Mikola Vasilko from London, the same that designed the church in Oakwell. So how many parishioners do you have? It's about 280 families. Really? Yes, but th that includes uh, widows, widowers, uh, larger families, uh, those that are already in a nursing homes, so we include them. They are members, they work for this church. They put their life and their uh, heart to this church. We count them as parishioners, as long as they're still alive. It's <laughs> that good. Uh, yes. Because of the unemployment, the very high unemployment in Windsor, they don't, cannot find a job, they don't stay here. A couple of families tried and went back to Toronto. We don't have newcomers. What about Spurschi? Harne Cheslo, Lemkivske, Hrodens, Spulschi, Ukrainske, Duzi Svidomi, Duzi Harne Parafiana, Mimai, Mospulschi. And there's a hall downstairs, I am. A beautiful I hall. I, you're very welcome to visit. And they're working the nice smell of cabbage yes. rolls. And all of you. <laughs> all of you. Tak, tak. It's a Mestaraimusha, but it's a Nazbirania fund, a fundraiser. You treba but it's a Razbilship, it's a Kupracher, a bit like me, my Maduja Harney, Vidanik Parafiani, Kiprehojat, Cerobliat, even Nerozumiat, so Cerco Potribuje, Financiu, should be splatchuvati, and Uderjuvati Cerco. Those are all of you. 
cabbage rolls, all up tea. I'm buying some to take back to Toronto because we don't have all up tea in Toronto. Um, but I told the ladies that um, I'm smelling them, that they're fresh out of the oven. And it's like God is calling me to buy all up tea, so I'm going to buy all up tea. Thank you. Well, it's lovely to see and to hear and to, to learn about this. And uh, God bless you and uh, oh. have another 40 years. Yeah, uh, yeah those, Another the, the, 40 years for you. Thank you very much. Bok swatcha tsumunye. Yeah, yak vim kwatcha. So that's the Ukrainian, my friends. The Ukrainian, my friends. Hi there, Ron Kahoot sitting here in my recording studio. I'm working on a, believe it or not, I'm working on a new booty album. It's been 14 years. But just a couple announcements coming up uh, uh, with, the, uh, with regards to the up-and-coming Canadian National Ukrainian Festival in Dauphin, Manitoba, August 2nd, 3rd, 4th. Uh, the headliners this year are the uh, a band called the Ukrainians. They're from England. And also Dar Mohrai, who is from Vinitsia in uh, Ukraina. They will be there as well. There's your headlining act this year for the for the Dauphin Festival, August 2nd, 3rd, and 4th. We'd also like to announce our winners, fourth call, and it's the fourth call from uh, every city that we're uh, broadcasting. L luckily, uh, there's only five. Uh, so here are the winners of the weekend pass for the Dauphin Festival, August 2nd, 3rd, and 4th of this year. The first one is D. Szczesniuk, it's a 780 area code, so I will assume it's uh, Edmonton or somewhere in Alberta. Nina Buks, uh, Butska, Toronto. Jerry Bureska from British Columbia. Uh, we get around, don't we? Uh, Linda Sass, Meath Park, Saskatchewan. And Lyubomir Shulakevich from Manitoba. Congratulations to the five of you. You have won a weekend pass for the Dauphin Festival coming up again August 2nd, 3rd, 4th. Make sure you come out there, see the Ukraine, hear the Ukrainians, see the Ukrainians, and see Dar Mohrai all the way from Ukraina. They're a folk ensemble, and they are incredibly good. So please make a point of getting out there. Again, congratulations to these five, and stay Ukrainian, my friends. <laughs> Sponsored by Ukrainian Credit Union, believe it or not, it's Ron Kahoot with Stay Ukrainian, my friends. We're Cossack children of his